Hey, namaste from Deepesh. Welcome to my YouTube channel of Power of D365. For those of you joining us for the first time, I invite you to hit the subscribe button to get tips and tricks on Power Platform and D365. In this tutorial, we will see that how we can leverage the power of AI models within the Power Automate to streamline the process of extracting data from PDF documents. And I am Deepesh Somani, Business Application MVP Illumine and MCD, co-founder and author to multiple Dynamics 365 books. So let's jump into the implementation. Here we are creating items in SharePoint list from the extracted text of PDF using Power Automate. So first you need to create your EIA model, log in into your Power Apps and open AI Hub from the sitemap. In AI model, you will get multiple options like AI models for text, AI models for images, so you need to select extract custom information from documents. This is a sample that how we need to train our AI model. So here we are creating custom model. Just click on create custom model. From here you can select your document type and we are going to select type as fixed template documents. These are some samples of fixed template documents. Now just click on the next. At this point, it is necessary to define the specific information that we intend to retrieve from the document. Before we specify the fields, let's check our template. This is the template from where we are extracting invoice number, total amount, date and even you can specify table. So let's specify fields here. So here we have specified these three fields and a table text type field for invoice number, number type field for total, and for date we have specified a date field, and we have specified a table with column in it. Now click on next and create a collection of documents. In this collection, you need to add the PDFs with same template. This PDF will help to train our AI model. Here we have added six PDFs with same template which have unique data in it. Click on next and now we need to tag our documents. For tagging columns, you just need to select the value and specify which column value is it. For specified table, select the whole table and set limit of rows and column. And then specify column in table and correct the layout of table. On the right side pane, you can see your file data in table format. You need to do this tagging process for all PDF for training your AI model. Click on next and in model summary, just click on train and then publish it. Let's create a cloud flow. 
But before creating, we need a SharePoint document library and a SharePoint list. Here we have a SharePoint list invoice list which have the same columns which we have created for our AI model. And we also have a document library. So whenever a new file is getting added in this library, Flow will extract the data from file and create an item record from the extracted data into the invoice list. Now let's create a flow, go to the flows and create an automated cloud flow. Provide a title to your flow and select when a file is created for trigger by SharePoint. Select your site address and library name. Now add new action date file content from SharePoint. In Get File Content, select Site Address and add dynamic content of identifier in File Identifier from Trigger. Click on New Action and select extract information from documents from AI Builder. In this action, select the AI model which we have created and select PDF document in form type Add dynamic content of file content from get file content in form. Now add one more action from SharePoint create item. In this action select site address and invoice list in list name. Click on show advanced option and select all items in limit columns by view. Add dynamic content of invoice number in title. Date value in date column and table 1 quantity value in quantity column. Total value in total. And table 1 description in description column. Now save and test your flow.
So let's test our flow. For that, we will upload this Python SharePoint document library. Click on test. Now go to SharePoint library and upload a file for triggering flow. As you can see, this flow gets triggered. Now let's check invoice list. So as you can see that records are getting created in this list. And these are the extracted data from the PDF which we uploaded in SharePoint document library. So this is how you can use AI models for extract text from PDF file. Thank you for watching this video, hope it was good for your learning and you gained something insightful, power 360 as usual guys till we meet in my next video.